listen to Cool Autumn Nights, and for the first time, we feel the focus and the pressure of time. In the fall, heroes are born, legends rise, and history is made. Fall is a time for greatness. Fall is winning time. Let's do this. This prospect has become the object of a notable sports management company's attention. However impressive an agent's qualifications may be, the trading in of a longtime trusted mentor for a corporate wheeler dealer can feel like a scary step. Some players may feel it wise to postpone such a change until compelled by necessity. Welcome to MLB The Show in this presentation of minor league baseball. Yo, Tonight, the second of Trenton three to start the week between the Thunder. Altoona Curve and the Trenton Thunder. It's baseball on the show, and it's coming up next.
Roger Cox out of the state of Arkansas is on the hill here. What do we need to know here, Danny? Hey, you always like to begin the season on a good note. In his first start of the year, he did just that, picking up the win. There's nothing he'd like to do more than to get number two in this one here. Play ball. Digging in, Jeff Lebowski. That and there's cool. a look at his home the and road fielder. splits so far yeah. this year. Lebowski. Here comes the first pitch. And he popped him up. Back into foul territory behind first. And no one can get there. He'll try it again. Another one fouled off, and he's quickly behind 0-2. On its way, the 0-2 pitch. Into right field, that's a base hit. The run comes across to score, and they jump ahead 1-0. Hey, that's a big RBI single right there, d -Row. They lost the first game of this series, and they certainly don't want to fall behind and may potentially lose the first two games of this set. Without question, Dan. Offensively, you're just trying to grind it out, give your team a chance, give the pitcher a chance to relax a little bit, even the series up, it. hopefully, and the fight it out stop. tomorrow. Mitch Coming to the plate Haynes. now, Mitch Haynes. And the home away splits tell us he's actually quite a bit better hitting on the road than he is at home. The 0-1 on its way. Smoke stand up right here, third. stand up, pick it up. And he has some trouble with it. And the effort pays off as he's able to recover and get the second out of the inning. And with that, here's a look at the visitors' starting lineup. Dero, tell us about this lineup as they try to force a rubber match in the series. Yeah, Matty, what I want you to focus on is the fact that this team does not like to run. Very station to station. It's going to take a couple of hits to score runs with this offense. They swing the bats well, but they don't put any pressure on the defense as far as base running. So coming Matty to the fit. plate, Johnny the Monahan hitter. looking for better Johnny results than last night when Monahan. he went 0 for 4 in that one. Hard hit stand ball up, to second. Up. Throw in time, and the side is retired. So one run on two hits, one error in the inning, and two men left on base. On now to the bottom of inning number one. The curve lead it one to nothing. Ready now, Jeff Lebowski. He came through two. with an RBI single yeah. in his last at-bat. Yeah, and he's got to feel super confident right now. He's the only real offense in this game. Guys on the mound have been executing every pitch. And here's a fastball called for strike one. Fly ball out to straightaway left. Anderson has a beat on it, and that retires the side. Nothing across here this half of the inning. We'll head now to the home half of inning number three. Altoona's out in front, one to nothing. Digging in for his second at bat, Anthony Deal. Go oh, for, for one for him here in this one. The third baseman, Anthony Deal. Pops this one up. Haynes onto the grass. He makes the catch. A great effort to get there and record the first out of the inning. What's the play ball? Ow. Three. Four, four, take your brain. He's safe. Now, he's out.
Now at the plate, Steve Castro. Leading off he got on top Thunder. of one and was a ground down victim last time. Steve Castro. Skied in the air to straightaway left. Lebowski is under it. One away. A little bit over halfway home tonight. Bottom of the fifth as we get a look at our line score to this point. And boy, just one hit for these guys. And they have not swung the bats well. That's putting it mildly. Play ball. You're out. Digging in once again, Jeff Lebowski. Lebowski. He flew the out in his last at bat. Jeff Lebowski. First delivery to him on the way. High fly ball out to straightaway center. Styles moves over. And he brings it in for the second out of the inning. Now back to the top of the lineup, the stepping baseman, in, Anthony seven. Deal. Anthony Deal. A one count, here's the pitch. That's popped up. Haynes is there, and the inning is over. Make it six shutout innings as he continues to give them fits out there. We're through six full. The curve lead it one to nothing. Digging in to try it again. Jeff Lebowski. Jeff Lebowski. First offering on its way. A pitch out. The throw. Not in time as he's able to thwart the pitch out. I'm not sure what else the defense could have done there. They pitched out and the throw was pretty good, but they still couldn't cut him down. You kind of just have to hope he gets a bad jump. Guerra stands at second with two gone. One ball, one strike, the count. A ball and two strikes now. The one, two. Swing and a ball lifted scored, in the on. air toward the line in right. Evans will reach out with one hand to make the catch on the move, and that ends the inning. So it's no runs, no hits, no errors, and one man left on. So close, but yet so far. Can you imagine giving up one hit, pitching such good baseball for nine innings, but one base hit kept him from baseball history? This evening's game finishes 2-0 the final score. Altoona jumped out to an early lead in the first and never looked back. Juan Ojeda gets the win on the mound his first of the year as he allows only one hit in nine full innings.
So that'll put a wrap on things here this evening. For my partners, Dan Plezak and Mark DeRosa, I'm Matt Vaskersian. This has been a special presentation of MLB The Show. For more, follow us on Twitter at MLB The Show. Our final line score, first for the victorious curve, two runs, six hits, two errors, they left eight men on base. Time of the ball game, two hours and...
The show's continuing coverage of Eastern and League now, Baseball is Joe on the air. Al tonight, Duda. the first of this three-game sure. weekend series between the New Hampshire Fisher Cats and the Altoona Curve. It's baseball. It's the show. And it comes your way next. Luis Fernandez will be on the mound for the series opener. Dan Plezak, what do you got? Here's a guy that numbers can be a little bit deceiving. He has a whip in the 1.3 area and above range. It's a little higher than league average. He's been a little bit inconsistent. One good game, one bad game, but don't let that one, whip one pull you. Stepping into the box, Richard Urena. Static second, the second baseman, Richard Urena. Goes the other way, and this is in the air out to left. Lebowski comes on now and puts it away for the second out of the inning. Time now to give you a look at the batting order for the visiting squad. Mark DeRosa, what do they have to do to get the season off to a good start on the road? Yeah, Maddie, this lineup has just gone cold. It happens from time to time, but somebody's going to have to create a spark. Hopefully, it's with the first two guys in the batting order. Three. Next will be the cleanup hitter, Batting Jeff four. Lebowski. The as he'll get his first opportunity yeah. in this one. Lebowski. From the stretch, here's the pitch. 0-1 the count. Well, you take a look at our visiting club as they take the field tonight. They come in not exactly setting the world on fire as they've dropped five of their last eight ball games. Yeah, Maddie. what I need to see out of this offense today is some early production. Somebody's got to get on, uh, on base and, and put the defense on their heels. They've been struggling recently. They're not swinging the bats well. They got shut out yesterday. And this off. And we'll have to leave it there as the play is made here to end the inning. We've played an inning. Still nothing, nothing.
Digging in now, Julio Pinto, runner in scoring the position with two gone. Julio Pinto. Ready with the one, two. Swing and a looper to left. Lebowski moving forward. He tracks it down, and that will end the inning. So they pick up a run on two hits, no errors, and a man left. On now to the bottom of the second. The Fisher Cats are out in front, one to nothing. Stepping in and ready for another shot. The Jeff left fielder, Lebowski. number two. His last at bat yeah. didn't go his way Lebowski. as he popped out in foul territory. Yeah, Matt, he's got to make an adjustment right here. His swing definitely broke down, dropped his back shoulder, and thus the result was a terrible pop up foul. No balls in one strike. Behind 0 and 2 now. Hit in the air out to right. And that will Already square up on that ball. Great job. Now, he'll be awarded second base here. It's a ground rule double. Hey, there's a hard hit ball that was going to be down for extra bases. The ball had some spring on it, and it bounced over the wall, and the ground rule double puts him on second base without having to leg it out. Now back. Stepping into the box, Mitch Haynes. Mitch. He'll try to follow up Haynes. the double in his last at bat with another big hit right here. Pickoff move to second, and he can't get back in time, and he is out at second. Play ball. Ow. 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 At the plate, John Lachlan. He got now on top it. of one and was Catch a ground out victim John. last time. Lachlan. Bases are empty here with two men out. Goes down to get this thing as this is lifted in the air to straightaway left. And he'll get there in plenty of time to put this one away, and that ends the inning. So they go quietly here in this half inning. Last half of the fifth coming up, all tied at one and one. Digging in, Jeff Lebowski. Now batting, left fielder, Jeff Lebowski. He's set and the pitch. And this is hit hard to the right side. Foul. He's ready. Here's the 0-1. Come on, go hard. You're scoring. That's going to be on. trouble. Now this will rattle up against the wall. And the runner will score from second. And now time is called here as their pitching coach is going to pay a quick visit to the mound to discuss how they want to attack things here. Ready once again, Mitch Haynes. The batter, one number for one. two with a double Short on the stop. ledger so far. Mitch Haynes. Hey. 
Line drive to left. Catch made in left. Here comes the runner. Throw back to second, and that's a double play. It's a run on two hits, one left. Seventh inning coming up. Altoona's out in front, two to one. Digging in the switch hitter, Richard Arena. Last time seven. through was a base Second hit. Baseman, Lynch Richard on at first, Urania. nobody out. Here's a weakly hit fly ball off to the left two, side. Two, two. Lebowski will settle under it to make the play for the first out as the runner will have to head back to first. Play ball. Ow. Trying to pick things up where we left now off. Batting. Jeff no Lebowski. Left fielder. Jeff Lebowski. He comes set. Here's the nothing and nothing pitch. No balls and a strike to count. On its way, the 0-1 pitch. And it's fouled away. And he fouls this one off. The next 0 2. And a diving effort, but this will just tip off his glove, and that's a base hit. Throw not in time, and he beats it out for his third hit tonight. Standing in, Mitch Haynes. The batter, number one. Shortstop, Mitch. Eighth inning, four to Haynes. one is our score. And he Zero. struck him out. Second time tonight now that he's been set down on strikes. Well, I have to give credit to him on the mound for not letting that previous pitch get to him. He wanted it, but he didn't get the call. But I love how he didn't let it affect him, and he comes right back with another good pitch and gets the punch out. Striding in, Jared the McDonald. Fielder, number he reached base on an error and later Jared came around to score last McDonald. time. McDonald. Hoping to send him packing. Pitch on its way. Now a swing and a ball popped in the air back behind short. Pinto ranges back and he has it for route number two. Striding forward now is the, the DH. designated hitter, Johnny number four. Monahan. He singled Johnny. his last time up. Yeah, and they Monahan. take another single right here. That third base coach is dying to wave his arms. I wouldn't be surprised if anything hit hard. Round it hard, round it hard. He's going to wave them. Pinto ranging into the outfield. He tracks it down, and that will end the inning. So it's no runs on two hits, no errors, and two men left stranded. We've played eight full. The curve lead it four to one. And they finished the month with a bang just the way you want to. A four to one finish in this evening's game. The Altoona Curve wrote an important sixth inning to victory in this one. Luis 
Fernandez with his fourth win this season. Ethan Leslie earns the save out of the bullpen, his 16th of the season. So that'll just about do it. For Mark DeRosa, Dan Plezak, and our entire crew, I'm Matt Vaskersian. This has been a presentation of MLB The Show. For more, don't forget to check out theshownation.com. Our final line score, first for the victorious curve, four runs on 11 hits, no errors, they left eight men on base. The game's future stars are on and display now, as your minor league baseball comes Al your Duda way on the show. Kerr. Tonight, game two of this three-game weekend series between the New Hampshire Fisher Cats and the Altoona Curve. It's baseball on the show, and it's coming up next. Tim Smith is on the mound for game two. What do we need to know here, Danny? Hey, man, this guy keeps his team in the ball game. He's won two of his last three starts, so he's been throwing the ball really well. And one of the keys for this guy is getting early outs to keep his pitch count down. If he can do that, he should be able to get into the seventh. Now to the plate, Jeff Lebowski. And he really the thrives fielder. in the batter's box yeah. here at home. Something to Lebowski. keep an eye on in this one. Here comes the first pitch. Good fastball as he gets the swing and a miss. Fellas are visiting team as they take the field after a scoreless top half. They dropped another one last time out, and in fact, they've won just twice in their last eight tries. Runner goes for second. Takes this the other way to right. In there, a base hit. And they won't even attempt to run on that arm in right, so despite the runner moving on the pitch, it'll wind up first and second here. He doubled up on the heater right there. First one, he blew right by him. Second one, timing was on point, Batting and he was fit. able to get a hit. The right fielder, Emilio Sandoval. Mine to the right side, and this is going to be a fair ball as it'll head to the corner. The run is in to score, and they take an early 1-0 lead. Dan, you were one pitch away from getting out of this. Two outs, two strikes on the batter, and he's able to throw out a ribby knock. Dero, it's hard to get more frustrated than that as a pitcher. You're one pitch away from getting out of a lot of traffic on the bases, getting into the inning, and next thing you know, you give up a two-out, two-strike base hit. Nothing more That's frustrating for a pitcher than to have yeah. that happen. Hey. Lebowski over at second. Sandoval at first, two out in the inning. Line drive to left. That's in there. Base hit. And a good throw will wind up holding that runner at third, so the bases become loaded now with two gone. Jared that is, that is. he'll get to take his first hitter. cuts here. Jared McDonald. Oh, and two. Here it is. Is put in play to the right side of the infield. Oh, and he can't come up with it. And that'll score the run from third as they go up two to nothing now. 
Boy, so frustrating as a pitcher. Two strike RBI base hit. The ball wasn't hit very hard, Dero, but from a hitter's perspective, you'll take it any way you can get it. Yeah, in today's day and age, where. Three! Three! Four, four! Take your base! Heat base! First base! He's out! Now at the plate, Luis Soto. Now he got on top of one and was a ground out victim Luis. last time. Soto. The 3 2 pitch. This is in the air to left field. And the two out threat will not come to pass as the inning is over. So they pick up no runs on no hits, no errors, and a couple of men left. We'll move on to the bottom of inning number three. Altoona's out in front, two to nothing. Stepping up to the plate, Jeff Lebowski. He reached on a single in his first try. The left fielder. One of the keys to securing yes. a win, they want to Lebowski. keep the pressure on and try to build that lead as much as they can moving into the later innings. Here it comes. Here and he throws the fastball by him here, 0-1. Hit hard on the ground. Run it out, run it out, run it out. Throw on to first in time, one away. Let's play ball. Three. Out. Out. Ball four. Three. Three. That's ball four. So striding in, Jeff. The Lebowski. left fielder, number two. Jeff. Lebowski. Looking to wiggle out of this. Here it is. High and deep to right. De La Rosa going back on it. He's got it. And they get out of the jam unscathed. Stepping up now, Richard Arena. He was drilled second by baseman. a pitch his last time Richard up. England Urania. on second. Pinto on at first with two down. A swing and a drive sent out toward the gap. Lebowski looking up, and that one is gone on a two strike count with two away in the inning. Yeah, he is kicking himself right now. He worked his tail off to get out of that jam and was one strike away from getting there. And then, boom, all that work goes to waste. From zero damage to a three-run homer in the blink of an eye. Let's play ball. Eight, nine, three. Zero. Three. Out, out. Three. 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 Eight, nine, out. Ball four. Take the ball. Out. Now batting, Luis Soto. And Dan, after that the home run, it looks like they five. might be able to end this Luis. losing streak that they've been Soto. mired in. Yeah, and a win at this level feels really good, especially when it's been a while. They're on their way if they can play well the rest of the game. And he popped him up, and that's going to fall for a base hit. 
And they'll put the brakes on that runner at third, and that means the bases are loaded now with two away. Hey, this is another one of those cases, D roll of not how many, but how many can you score? Lots of traffic, 100%. So here's the cleanup hitter, Jeff Lebowski. He flew out in his no last at bat. Even though we're moving yeah. into the back end of this Lebowski. game, they're only down by a couple of runs. You know that old slogan of bloop and a blast? They could certainly use that right now. Into the windup, here comes the 0 and 1. It's a high fly ball headed for the left field corner. If it stays fair, it's gone. Nearly a big fly to start the inning instead of foul ball. The pitch. Right down Main Street caught him looking. What's the play ball? Three. Ladies and gentlemen, you're at now in the box, Jeff Lebowski. Leading He'll be off. the one to get us Four going here in the bottom of inning no number nine. Fielder. Jeff Bonnie pops it up. Lebowski. And that'll get down for a base hit. Lead off hitters aboard, and that means the time run will come square up here in job. the late innings. Hey, pitchers, you better start taking notice of this guy. He better be circled on that lineup card because he's on fire. That's his second the right hit of the fielder, ball game right 13. there, and I don't see him stopping. Emilio. Lebowski. And the ball. Here at first with nobody out. And there he goes towards second. Here's a little chopper up the middle. And the off-balance throw beats him at first, and that's a tough play. Digging in and looking for more, Mitch. The Haynes. batter, number he one. Singled his last Should time stop. up. Mitch. Runner at second here with Haynes. one man out. On the ground. Beat it out! Third. Beat it out! Beat it out! A tag for one. Play ball. Three. It's a 4-3 finish in this evening's ball game. The Fisher Cats used a nice fifth inning to take the lead, and they never gave it back. Rico Sierra earns his third win of the year in relief. Arturo Acosta wraps it up for the save, his 15th of the campaign. So that's a wrap for us here tonight. For my partners in the booth, Mark DeRosa and Dan Plezak and our entire crew, I'm Matt Vaskersian. You've been watching MLB The Show. And for more, click over to theshownation.com. In a close game like this, you look for that one guy who produced when it mattered most, and this is the guy. He's our tops player of the game. Yeah, he certainly was a big part of this victory. Picked up four RBIs in the game, so it's safe to say that he came through when they needed him to. The final line score for our ball game. For the victorious Fisher Cats, four runs on six hits, one error they left.
Time for minor league baseball here on the and show now, as we set our up. sights on the double A Eastern League. Eerie. Tonight it's the first of three to start the new week between the Altoona Curve and the Erie Seawolves. It's going to be a premier pitching matchup. Two of the league's hardest throwers go head to head next. Bernardo Pena gets the call for game one of the series. Dan Plezak, what's the word on him? Hey, this guy has really struggled coming into this game, right? The league is hitting just under 300 against this guy, and that's something he really needs to improve on. And it'll be interesting to see if that trend continues in this start here. So now it'll be the four-hole hitter, four. Jeff Lebowski. Day off for him yesterday, yeah. but back out Lebowski. there for this one. Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. Strike one to start the at-bat. Fellas are home nine as they begin play here this evening. They come in looking to make it two in a row as they were winners last time out. Hey, why not get on a hot streak, Matty? They played really well yesterday. Continue that trend. Stay up. And we'll have to leave it there as the play is made here to end the inning. Three. Three. Bottom of the second here with no score. Batting fifth, the first baseman, Allen Yabu. This is hit high in the air out toward left center. Lebowski sprinting after it. He gets there, and that's the second out. Let's play ball. Three. Out. Four, four. Take the break. At the plate, Jeff the Lebowski. Two, two on, two out for him yeah. here in the third. Lebowski. <laughs> He's ready. Here's the first offering. Popped him up. Yabu has room in foul territory. And that ends the inning. So it's no runs on a hit, no errors in two. Striding in once again, Jeff the Lebowski. Fielder, Third two. trip to the plate for yeah. him here tonight. 0 for Lebowski. 2 at this point. Eight. First pitch fastball one in one there one for a called strike. So earlier in the broadcast, we mentioned that we might be seeing a pitcher's duel today, and these two guys have certainly delivered on that promise. Yeah, Matty, executing a game plan to a T. Both guys with big power arms, establishing the fastball, and then using their off speed to get these guys and keep them honest. You know what, Dero, in the day and age where we're seeing a lot of high scoring games, it's kind of refreshing to see two pitchers on point the like they are in this one. one. Runs Short going stop. to be at a premium. Mid. Both these guys look super Pain. locked in. The one two. Grounded go, 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 go. Side, side. He's got it. Beckham for one. But no real oh, shot at two as he's safe easily at first. 
So they avoid what could have been a costly double play there. Yeah, Matt, credit the batter for busting out of the box and hustling down the line instead of getting mad at himself for rolling over on a ground ball. It's little things like that that can change the whole game. Play ball. Ball four. Take the base. That's ball four. Ball four. Take the base. Ball four. Take the base. Three. Three. Striding into the box. Now Jeff batting. Lebowski. He singled his yeah. last time up. Lebowski. First pitch of the at bat on its way. Fouled away. The windup and the 0-1. Fouled off. One out, nobody on. Now a half swing, but it's strike three anyway, says the home plate umpire, and that's out number two. You know, I'm not quite sure how that strikeout will be scored, looking or swinging. He tried to check his swing, but I'm pretty sure the home plate umpire was ringing him up regardless. Play ball. Three. He's out. 